Hello my beautiful souls and welcome to my channel. Let's do a quick check of uh, the energy of the person um, that you're asking about, their thoughts about you today, whenever you watch this reading, okay? So you may choose from those three piles, pile one, pile two or pile three. And we're gonna look at their energy towards you today, their thoughts of you today. Choose your card, choose your pile, just relax and um, let's start with pile number one. Hello pile one, whoever chose this owl, let's see what are their thoughts of you today. <laughs> right away, this person loves you, this person has feelings for you. If this is not love related, it just means this person is uh, seeing you as very balanced, very loving person, very nice person. They have a positive, positive thoughts of you today. But let's see um, what else, their thoughts of you today. Huh. Wow. Another thing that I see here is this person is thinking that for some reason, they cannot reach out to you today or they cannot uh, talk to you right now. Maybe because you got in certain fight or disagreement or you blocked somebody, them, or they blocked you. Or something happened here that they don't know how to get to you. They have feelings, but they don't know what to do with those feelings, how to reach out to you, how to tell you. It could be in their head as well. It doesn't have to be like literally they uh, cannot reach out to you. But something blocks them from uh, talking to you right now but they want it badly they want to resolve something here uh they're not at ease right now even that they see you as the queen of cups any gender they still are uh, upset maybe there is some jealousy going on maybe just um uh, the situation itself doesn't allow them to um, be around you to talk to you to get in good terms with you so they kind of upset what else Yes, maybe there was certain uh, even betrayal here or argument, disagreement. Something happened here, basically. Somebody left the situation or literally left you or them. Uh, I don't see that you're right now talking to each other or you in certain communication. Even if you are, it's mostly like an, an, a negative uh, vibe. But just know, no matter what's going on behind the scenes, this person has feelings for you. And if it's not love situation, still, this person doesn't uh, think that you are ba you're bad or something wrong with you. They just uh, angry at the situation itself, okay? So if you thought things, yeah, if you thought that uh, this person somehow changed their mind about you or their feelings have changed, no, the situation changed okay but not their feelings or their thoughts of you it didn't change here okay uh, this person still sees you as their soulmate maybe or uh, their friend or whoever you are to each other okay here feelings didn't go anywhere just the situation is that way and we're not looking at their actions or anything we're just uh, checking their vibe their energy towards you and how they see you today as the queen of cups <laughs> Thank you, pile one. Let's look at pile number two. Hello, pile two, whoever chose this Sunday. Let's see, what are their thoughts about you today, person you're asking about? The hermit. Hmm. Let me confirm something here. Their thoughts about you, how they see you. Uh, it could be that you uh, recently had certain conversation with this person or you recently agreed on something maybe you will have a meeting with them or you planning to go somewhere together or something like that and they're thinking about your last uh, conversation uh, even if it just was friends or co-workers or whatever it is uh, however um, you connected here the connection could be like not just love could be anything this person is thinking about your last conversation or they thinking about the plans that you have together something here you planned or um 
they're thinking about that matter what else they're thinking about today here and now when you watch this reading For some of you, just for some, if there is a third party situation or there are third people or someone's married or whatever's going on here or the work um, doesn't allow you to have a relationship, I don't know, some obstacles, this person is thinking um, they're kind of not upset that I would say they don't really like those obstacles between you they don't really like the situation but they still admire you and see you as very um i hear honest person very productive person very attractive person or maybe if you work together uh, you are very good at following i hear following directions um finishing certain projects it's very good to work with you it's very good to communicate with you even if it's love situation they like this uh, communication connection with you but something is in, in between that doesn't allow them to actually be honest and tell you how they really feel something is uh, blocking them from doing that what else they're thinking about you If you're waiting for this person to tell you um, the truth or to tell you how they feel about you, what they think, in a close future, they cannot. they just tell me right now, I cannot tell them the truth. But this is not the bad truth. It's just the truth about what, how they feel, what they think, what's bothering them. Uh, but with the chariot, there is a chance or um, there could be that in the future, they will show up or they will tell you. Something here that's blocking them. They have inner conflict here, this person, about the situation between you. And I see that um, they will get to a certain point in time, but it's going to be more into the future. We're not looking at their actions right now, just channeling their thoughts. They uh, eventually, they will suddenly or they may suddenly start um, approaching you or telling you something here. They saying I have responsibilities. Uh, I have to. I cannot. I know you're waiting some uh, for some actions from me, but right now it's impossible for some reason. I don't know what reason it is here. They tell that they have to be in a temperance right now. They cannot really act in a certain way that you want them to act, maybe, or to change something that you want them to change. Just because right now is not the right time, or right now the situation doesn't seem like they can do it. But there is a chance, or there is a hope in the future that they will at least that's how, yeah in the future they may contact you or tell you something but today they cannot and it actually uh, saddens them they, they feel sad about this whole situation but they still see you as very valuable they see that uh you deserve the best or you you just uh, they see you in a good um they see you as a nine of pentacles and they have hope that in the future things may be different if you're not together right now they hope that in the future you will be uh, it's just more of a hope here rather than action okay but this person definitely is thinking about some situation or conversation with you thank you pile two let's go for pile number three hello pile three whoever chose this biscuit um let's see what are their thoughts about you today the moon hmm I feel the vibe of a person that has an ego. Let me describe you the energy that I pick up. This person has a certain ego. This person is not used to missing on someone. This, this person is not used to have maybe even feelings for someone. They used to control their emotions, but with you, they cannot. With you, this person cannot control their emotions, okay? Interesting. What is this about? Wow. Uh, first of all, I want to say, for those who are, for example, this person is married or you married and you are lovers, this person cannot really express their true feelings to you because they have some responsibility, they have a family. This is just for some 
please don't tell me uh, this is a, a, about third party. I have to say certain things. I cannot just, you know, because somebody doesn't like those things, I cannot not say them. Anyways, for others, this person would love to be have you as a family. They would love to have you as a friend, depending on who you are looking at, okay? But right now, um, with the High Priestess, they have to hide their feelings. They have to hide their emotions for some reason. Again, maybe because of their ego, maybe because of an obstacle. Uh, this person could also be jealous. If you are with somebody else, this person has a lot of jealousy, which they don't show. Because of their pride, maybe. Could be like that too. Okay, what else are they thinking about you, pile three? Mm. Huh. They say... Um, I had to leave the situation because uh, we have some um, difficulties, we have some differences, could be religious differences, uh, as I said, third party uh, situation, it could be obstacles, whatever obstacles you have here, but they're angry at themselves that they cannot uh, express themselves, they cannot show you or they cannot be with you. This person is upset that they love you. Okay, let's say it that way. This person is upset that they love you. And it might sound harsh, but that's the energy that I pick up. They're upset that they're not with you. They're upset that they cannot be your friend or anymore. If it's you're looking for like some friendship situation. Uh, maybe they cannot work with you anymore. They cannot connect with you anymore. Something going on here. Maybe you left. Maybe you're not... Um, giving them any more energy or you don't uh, you know meet up anymore something here ended and they're upset even if they're the ones who broke this connection yes anger a lot of uh, anger disagreement disappointment even there could have been a betrayal here this person is not happy with what they said maybe maybe they uh treated you wrong or they said something um mean to you and they're upset with themselves but they have this pride that they cannot say sorry uh, you know there is a song i just remembered um sorry is how do how is it something about it's difficult to say sorry i don't remember the song i think it's by elton john um i don't know if it's an old song but um, Maybe you listen to this song and you will um, understand something there. They wanna, by, by the way, they wanna come back, but um, they're not looking at their actions, but they right now decide to just sit quietly because they are indecisive in their head. What should they do next? They didn't decide yet, should they come back, should they say sorry, should they change the situation. They didn't decide. Their pride right now is playing with them, with their mind. But the fact that they love you or they care for you or they miss you is not going anywhere. So today this person extremely hurt from the whole situation. Extremely hurt. I just wanted to ask what about you and you don't really care in the world or you kind of maybe moved on or you don't expect them anymore you don't expect their sorry you uh, you just right now in a full energy you maybe even um, taking care of yourself maybe you going out maybe you talk to your friends uh, maybe even you going on dates or you just live in your life while this person is upset maybe in the beginning you were the one who were upset now it's kind of changed now they're the one who's uh, feel this difficulty when it comes to this situation. I feel, I sense lots of regret for coming from this person. But they're not right now. They don't want to do anything because they didn't decide yet how to do it, what to do. They're still hopeful that this situation will go and they will move on. They're still hopeful that they can handle it and it will be fine. It's just, you know... One of those days when they miss you more than they should or they care for you more than they should. Um, that's why they're indecisive right now. But the strength of their uh, pull towards you is unbelievable. Especially whenever you watch this reading. Okay? 
So that was your reading pile 3. Thank you very much, guys. Let me know in comments. I love you all, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.